So I'm doing Uber today and I ran into a celebrity, I guess. And her name is Sydney Geyer. Um, she left her phone in my car actually. So I'm about to go give her back her phone, but I'm in Palm Beach Gardens and I dropped her off at home. You know, her car's in the shop. She had an oil leak and she's getting it fixed. So she was doing Uber. Uh, she went out and got a massage and everything. I'm gonna show you who I'm talking about. You know, she's older now, but she was real young back then. And she did, uh, I think it was a show for Oprah and it was called Mr. Romance, if you look it up. But uh, yeah, so that was pretty cool. I just uh, made sure I had to make a little small clip of this to let y'all know. I thought that was pretty cool. So this was the lobby where she lived at. You couldn't even get to this point without security letting you in. It was crazy. It was top flight security over there. But anyway, let's get to today's video. Bro, it's been over a week. It's been over a week since I seen my truck, so I don't even remember if left trash in it or what, how I left the truck. I don't remember where the fuel's at or nothing, but it's been over a week. I can't wait. Here now. Oh, yeah. She's so pretty. She's so pretty. Yeah. Oh, girl looking nice, boy. Bro, $5.95 a gallon. I wanted to make a quick video because I've been having a few people ask me about, is it a good time to move to Florida? Does Florida load pay? You know, because they're a truck driver trying to stay local. And they're owner operators and they want to stay local. It's crazy how many people are trying to move to Florida. Florida is now the most expensive state to live in. And I'm getting all these people asking if they should move to Florida. I mean, and they want to know how much is paying per mile Florida to Florida, you know, because they plan on getting a business. So I'm going to open up the Florida load board and I'm, you're going to take a look, a look with me in the, the, the Florida load board. Well, the load board, but Florida to Florida. Um, do I think it's a good time right now? I, I mean, I personally don't think it's a good time because like I said, it is the most expensive place right now to live. It sucks right now, yes, it, that sucks. But um, Florida, I love Florida. So if you were, you know, whatever state you're in, you don't like it, yeah, I mean, move. You know, you might not be able to buy a semi and, you know, start your owner op journey in Florida. Um, you Or you can come here and go out of state. You know what I mean? You don't have to stay in Florida. You go out of state, run your route, come back home. Come back home for the weekend. Come back home next, you know, in, in a month or so. I don't I don't know what your plan is. But if you're trying to stay local, I'm going to show you these routes. They're not really paying. Especially right now, fuel prices for diesel is $5.90 a gallon. It is, ex it, bro, when I say it's expensive, it is crazy expensive. You're talking about almost 6 bucks. Let's go ahead and take a look at this low board real quick. So, your boy just landed this route. It does have two stops, Kissimmee to Orlando. Yeah, you know, but uh, I jumped on it to get me into the circle of things. I'm not going to go up to Jacksonville much more. I'm going to stay, you know, pretty much local. But anyway, uh, a lot more local. Not going so far because my back is killing me, man. Um, I did get this uh, Lakeland to Miami for a backhaul right here. So I'm definitely going to run this route. Um, but the whole point of this video is to show you what the going rate is. Oh, well, we'll go back to that. So the going rate for this is $4.03. And that's why I jumped on this route because of 
you know, how, how much it was paying per mile. And then also Indian towns, not far from my house at all. You know, it only took me like 40 minutes to get here. And then, so then we got, uh, this one, this one coming back South, which I tell you South to North or North to South pays the best, you know, in this situation, it didn't pay the best, you know, $2.96 a mile. Um, let's go, let's search it right now. Miami to Florida. What's today's date? Cause I got to get something. Let me see. This one delivers on Monday, the 16th at 9 AM in Miami. So I got to look for something that picks up, you know, around noon in Miami on the 16th going North. So Miami, Florida to Orlando. And that's why I'm on this one. Let's refresh it and see if anything's changed since the last time I looked. Yo, this Miami to Palm Coast with six stops, that's insane. Okay, so the going rate, you can see, is a little, right now, it's a little over $3. But I guarantee this Jupiter right here to Orlando is Pepsi. And that's why they're paying so good, because nobody wants to do that. Let's see it, bro. Um, see where they're at. Yeah, for Pepsi lows, the drivers will walk up. The self-checkout kiosk, see, that's what I'm saying. No, nobody wants to take that that load. That's probably why it's paying that price, $3.48 a mile. Um, let's see. This one's $3.14 a mile. That ain't bad. Let me see. I don't know where this place is at, though. By Tampa or... Okay. You know, I could probably get a backhaul that lands in Winter Haven coming back. Let's see what else is there, though. All right. So, let me see. We got Jupiter to Lakeland. I want something coming out of Miami, though, to be honest with you. So, let me go here. Since I'm in Miami, I'm going to put this down to 50 miles real quick. 50-mile radius. This one's Coral Spring, the Winter Park. Picks up at 11 a.m. Uh, my load delivers at what time? 9, I said. It delivers at May 16th at 9 a.m. So I'd only have two hours to get um, to my pickup. That's pretty close together. I don't know if I want to do that, but... And Winter Park is 6 a.m.? No, nah, I don't want to do that. Miami Lakeland, okay, Fort Fort Lauderdale to Sanford, $2 a mile. See, this is what I'm saying. To me, none of this is worth it, bro. I'm not even going to lie to you. This is terrible. Miami to Vero Beach. Vero Beach is right up the road. This is this might be a good one here. Medley to Ocala. Miami Lakes to Melbourne. That ain't bad. I like these Miami Lakes to, uh, they got one more in Orlando. I think I'm going to call about those, the company. See, it says Trinity Logistics, gives me the number and everything. I'm about to give him a call and see what the going rate is for them. Once I get another camera, you know, I record me, give, you know, calling brokers and setting up, you know, and booking loads. But I'm thinking for sure. There's some, there's some routes on here now. Like, I'm not even going to hold you. Let me let me call let me call some of these Miami Lake runs going up to Orlando. That would be my best bet. Yeah, so that route didn't work because she wanted me to pick up at, like, 2 in the afternoon, but then it delivered straight through, like, 8 at, at, eight at night or something like that. But I can't do that because I'll be on my way south anyway. I'll, you know, take that two hours just to get to Miami get unloaded and everything else it wouldn't work for me i'm looking for something that delivers the following day so let me get back on that low board all right let's look miami to lakeland bro that's this is what i'm saying if you ask me if it's worth coming to florida right now it is not not with not with the price of everything going up and the rates that you know they're trying to pay people man this this is really bad it sucks man it really does i'm not gonna lie to you miami lakes to melbourne that's a good one.
Shoot. All right, let me give them a call real quick. All right, so I'm not finding anything um, that I want to book today. So I'm going to wait till tomorrow and get back on the low board and see what else comes out. Um, I'm going to get back on the low board right now, though, and show you guys, you know, maybe uh, Jacksonville down to Miami. So you can see, you know, once I get back in the swing of things, you know, I'm going straight to Jacksonville and doing that. Jacksonville to Miami, Miami back to Jacksonville. Because that's where you make the most money. So we'll see what they got going. All right. So we're going to twist this up. Jacksonville, Florida. Miami, Florida. Go. Oh. I mean, even see North coming south isn't paying the way it should be. You know, this is Medley's just outside of, you know, Miami. It is Miami, basically. Uh, $2.96 a mile. Let's look at this going rate, bro. They are, it's, it's bad. You know, just a couple months ago, all of this was, you know, three fifty, four dollars $4 a mile. You know what I'm saying? You, you, you find it, finding loads all day for like 1200 coming south. Jacksonville to Miami, this is $2.15 a mile. Let me try it. Let me see. Let me go look for a different day. Let's go. For Friday, Let's just say the thirteenth. See, and this is for tomorrow. There's no urgency or nothing, man. They are not paying. How is the fuel prices skyrocketing, but the price of freight is going down, and it really is going down, like two two dollars and eighty five cents a mile. You know what I mean? That's not that's not good money. I mean, even if you call this guy and get an extra hundred dollars, that's still a thousand fifty. That's nothing. That's that's still shy of, of uh, three dollars a mile. You know what I mean? This one's paying good. This one right here. You see this one? This one's three dollars and ninety-two cents a mile. Jacksonville to Hollandale. You know, something like this because I, because I I'm, I'm looking at it and I see it now and it's paying so good. This is what the prices were just a couple months ago, but. I'm looking at this, and I can see that it's paying good, so I know that it's going to be crazy times. Like it shows right now. It shows midnight, you know, 12, basically 12.56, so almost 1 a.m. to pick up. And nobody's in Jacksonville at 1 a.m. looking for a route. So I'm down in Indian Town, man. This country driving is killing me. These love bugs, this is love bug season in Florida, and they're everywhere. Let me show you what a love bug is. These right here are the love bugs. Stick to each other. Make love. I, I don't remember how. I gotta look it up. I just got back to the yard. Hey, man, that route, that, that. That uh, th that pickup that I just did, that wasn't supposed to be done until I wasn't supposed to be there till one o'clock. It's 1:18 now, and I'm already back to the yard. They got me out of there at like 12:30, so that was quick and easy. And tomorrow I got the two stops, Kissimmee, and then I run up to Orlando. I gotta be in Kissimmee by 7:30, eight is the latest. I'm supposed to be in Orlando, and then I got to run down to, um, what was that other shit? Oh, yeah, I got to run down to Lakeland after that, and then when I get to Lakeland, I'll come home, and then I'll deliver into Miami the following Monday. Anyway, I just want to make that quick video, man, about the low board here in Florida since everybody's trying to move here. Uh, to me, it's not a good idea, not at all. It's a terrible idea. Um... Unless you plan on leaving Florida. If you plan on staying local, it might not be the time to move down here yet. Uh, Y'all go ahead and subscribe for me. Please, subscribe. I don't know. I might go ahead and uh, Uber for the rest of the day. I'm not sure yet. I'm about to see what the old lady's doing, take her out for lunch or something.